and what's happening people this is triple code broker and today I'm gonna show you how to sort when you have two key value items in C++ so this is an example I'm gonna be using these five circles need to be sorted alright and they have to be sorted in the ascending order firstly based on the S variable which is the size of them and secondly in the based on in the on the amount of dots they have inside them. Right? So the result should be this one. Here. There you go. That's how they must be sorted. So they have the same size, these two circles, but this one has less dots. Alright? So let me show you how to code it. There we go in the code blocks. There you go with the libraries you, you, you will need using namespace std and the declaration of my vector here vector of pair that's the magic word of integers integer the size integer is the dots all right and circles name so that's the, dictual, the declaration there we go with the main function right here loading that's the three variables i'm going to be using nsd n is the size of my vector, s it is, is the size of the circle, and d is the amount of dots. So there I load the size, and now I'm gonna load the circles, push back them in my vector. So I'm loading the size and the dots, and then I push back the make pair thing, make pair, remember this command, S, the first key value item, which is the size. D, the second key value item, which is the amount of dots. Now sorting, as usual, from the beginning to the end. And now outputting. The vector sorted is. Now to refer to the first key item, you have to refer to the ith position of my vector, dot first. And the same goes with the second key item, right? So that's pretty much my code and let's build and run to check it out. Insert the size of a vector, let's say five. Insert the size and the dots of each circle. So let's use the example I used before, seven, two, seven, three, one, two, ten, three, ten, two, I don't know if this is 10 one. So let's check it out. There you go, smaller size, then we have the same size. So we go to the dots. And that goes to the same here, right? So this code here actually works when you have two key value items. So if you liked it guys and wanna see how to sort with more than two key value items, let me know in the comments section below. The code will be in a link in the description also. So if you liked it, please subscribe and I will make more videos for you guys so you will have less bugs. Did I just say that? Less bugs? Anyway, see you the next time, time guys. Goodbye.